Hello my friends, uh, welcome. This is Market Commentary uh, with uh, Axiori and I have to start with interest rate decision in uh, Australia. Uh, we got a rise uh, as anticipated, uh, but you can see that Australian dollar is going uh, lower. This is Australian dollar to American dollar. Uh, normally, uh, when you have an interest rate rise, you should see the rise of the value of the currency. Why it's different this time? Well, first of all, uh, the rise uh, was already priced in. It was expected. And uh, you know how it is in uh, trading by the rumors, sell the facts. Uh, but what is causing a reversal here, what is causing a drop on Australian dollar uh, here is a statement uh, from uh, Reserve Bank of Australia. Uh, because they, uh, well, they acknowledged uh, rising inflation, uh, they acknowledged um, lower growth uh, perspectives, but what they did is they abandoned forward guidance um, and they um, said that they will have more uh like flexible approach uh, towards uh, rates uh, depending on the data and this was perceived as uh, dovish this was uh, perceived as a negative sign for the australian dollar uh, that maybe 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 we will not have uh, so many uh, rates uh, rises in the future as previously anticipated and this is causing a drop on the australian dollar this is australian dollar to american dollar for example uh, but also it's happening against the uh, British pound or uh, Swiss franc uh, as well. Uh, so uh, there is a big, big sell signal for the Australian dollar. Another thing uh, which you may be interested in is the decline on uh, stocks. As you can see, this is uh, past two days. Um, this is, for example, DAX, but this is happening uh, also on other, on other indices. And in general, kind of a risk uh, off mode. This is, for example, uh, American dollar to Japanese yen. You can see <laughs> Japanese yen is, 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 is strengthening. It looks like uh, money is uh, heading towards safe havens. The same goes with gold, for example. Gold is climbing higher. How is it explained uh, by the media, by experts? Well, of course, um, it's explained by Nancy Pelosi uh, anticipated. A trip to Taiwan. Uh, it is not clear yet if she will arrive to Taiwan really. Uh, it is anticipated that she will today but there's uh, no like uh, concrete confirmation uh, of uh, this. Why is it important for the markets? Well of course uh, Taiwan uh, is a problem uh, between um, China and United States and uh, this uh, causes some uh, speculations about a possible war. We don't need another war, of course. Uh, war at the early stages, at least at the early stages, is definitely bad for the markets. Why is it early stages? Because it is uh, shown that in later stages uh, wars are bullish uh, for stock markets. But in early stages this uh, uncertainty is definitely negative and this is why we have a risk off mode. So traders are avoiding risk and they are heading with their money towards safe havens like for example the yen and uh, gold and they are escaping stocks that's why you can see uh, most recent declines on uh, major indices thanks very much for watching and i wish you all the best in your trading